kind of want to go to a position that the Vikings have kind of been linked to. Uh, I'm curious to hear your thoughts even after the draft that they had last year. And that that's the cornerback position. I think that this is a really talented group. I think that you have a lot of good size with a bunch of different guys, guys like Christian Gonzalez, Joey Porter Jr. I'm curious who you think uh, is, is your, your CB one. Uh, and then, you know, how many of these guys are our first strong guys? It's funny. Cause this are uh, like, like I think the cornerbacks, it's one of the strengths of this, this entire draft class. And the the thing that really sticks out about, about it. And, and in part, like the, the whole, the draft class as a whole, the, the outside uh, press man uh, uh, corners, the, the length of them uh you know like like the frames and 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 the 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 arm length um and yet the my top cornerback it's not the the size guy it's it's Devin Witherspoon I just love that kid's game I absolutely love that kid's game uh and he just shut everybody's lights out this past season nobody can get away from him he, he like he is in your hip pocket from the time the game starts and then when you try to go into the tunnel at halftime he following you into the tunnel. You cannot get away from Devin Witherspoon. You try to get on the bus. Devin Witherspoon's followed you out of the bus. Uh, he, he is just so damn sticky. He's so damn feisty. I, I like his game so much. Uh, so, like, for me, that, like, if it's my job that's on the line in this class, like, and 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 I know the other guys, their measurables are better. Like, Christian Gonzalez, his measurables are going to be better. Uh, um, uh, Porter's certainly bigger. You know, like he fits the 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 uh, you know the the press man ethos more. Cam Smith is going to be more athletic. You know, you go, Kelly Ringo, he way more athletic and, and way bigger. Everything like that. I don't care. I'm taking Devin Witherspoon as the first cornerback. I I know a lot of people have it like closer. It's more fluid. Whatever. Um, for me, that's the receiver position was where it's like more like I need to wait till the combine. But I will say this: unless Devin Witherspoon falls on his face during the athletic testing or he, he like measures in like and it's way off where illinois had him in conjunction with that he he gonna be my my cornerback one that what he did last year it's just too impressive for me to turn away from that yeah he's uh he's definitely someone that's been especially lately i think people have just started to watch his film a little bit more and, and he's really rising up which is fun because he's even even not even this past year, the the year before, that dude is tenacious. He is someone that is like you said, everywhere. He is literally in in your hip pocket. He it doesn't matter if it's in the trenches, it's in the slot, deep down the field. That dude is not going to lose many matchups. He is it's it, it, and it's kind of a reason why I also like Clark Phillips is yes. because they don't have that size. But those dudes compete. They are ultimate competitors. And it is, yeah, you know, even you look at one thing I'd challenge people to watch with Clark Phillips is watch his matchups against Jordan Addison. Jordan Addison yes. made a lot of defensive backs look really stupid because he is so good at creating separation. And Clark Phillips didn't let that happen. Mm -hmm. He was sticky. Yeah, exactly. There, there were times where it was, even if he got beat, Clark has a lot of good quickness to be able to catch up. And he's so smart when the ball is in the air, he's not going to high point the ball. A lot of guys are probably just going to be able to beat him that way, but he's so good at seeing where they're coming down to be able to punch the ball out too. And I think those are the kinds of guys to me that are, are really fun. Don't be wrong. Joey, Joey Porter jr. Super talented, has the name that everybody recognizes. Christian Gonzalez is on the way up, coming from Colorado to Oregon. And then Keely Ringo is just, I think that he's super aggressive. Obviously, it gets him in trouble at times. But, you know, there's there's a ton to like with so many of these guys. So it's almost like you want you almost want to be a little bit different to find a guy like Devin Witherspoon, who it's like, I know what I'm getting from him. I'm not, I don't have to bet on anything because it's on film. He's going to test a certain way. And it's going to be just more things that I have like right here. This is my, why we should draft Devin Witherspoon. There is no, like we have to project that he's going to be good at this or that he's going to be good at that. And I think that that's what I like that he's your CB one is because you know what you're getting. There's no, no concerns there's no questions about what you're getting you know exactly what you're getting with him dude a thousand percent and i love what you said about clark phillips i'm I'm totally with you uh i will have clark phillips ranked above where the consensus is on him for sure and i was totally with you with the the usc game uh it was striking him against addison in the uh pac-12 championship game um i remember i wrote a tweet because i like i, I think i said something like uh 
he he has Jordan Addison in witness protection because it was just like oh my god like you don't see Jordan Addison get a race off the whiteboard like that and it, it like he just like he there was large portions of that game where he's just a non-factor he was literally on a milk carton um and 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 what you said it, it's totally right like Jordan Addison gets that natural I'm sorry that separation as naturally as you and I breathe against other cornerbacks with Clark Phillips uh-uh no 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 um and so th- there's other like th- you know like the th- the guys that Clark Phillips may in the NFL that m- he might struggle more against are like the the taller stronger kind of guys but like uh in you you could situationally try to you know g- get them on the guys uh the, the the wouldn't be the size mismatches he, he the guy like um uh Kelly Ringo would get annihilated by Jordan Addison so like I don't like the thing of like Oh, you know, um, uh, Clark Phillips, you know, there, there's guys that are going to uh, nullify him in the NFL without mentioning the other side of it of like, yeah, Kelly Riggo, uh, he can't really uh, uh, move directions really well. And, and, and his instincts aren't very good and, and stuff like like I realize he's he's a really good north to south size speed like a freak. Uh, but but uh, yeah, I mean, like they're a, a receiver type that would annihilate him and did, you know. For sure. For sure.